Hi, this is Highbridge Motorhomes Devon Branch and on this uh, rather gloomy 6th of May 2023 we are doing our monthly Devon Motorhomes vlog where we have a quick walk around the forecourt chat about what's going on, new van used wise, what's going on in the industry and we see what's new down here so 6th of May or 8th of May, whatever date I said it just is it's very quiet here, it's a Saturday and that's because there's some some event or other going on in London with a with a hat being put on someone. So we're taking this advantage while it's quiet to do our monthly walk around. So we'll uh, have a little look at the new vans first. So I recently did, uh, if you check it out on the YouTube page, um, a walk around on what new vans we have which are available, which we do have some available for sale immediately, and uh, what's new there. So availability of new stock in terms of fresh orders everything is is running low to running out if you're interested in adria you're not going to find any on four courts to look at per se but we do have limited availability left of price protected 23 model adrias to be delivered at the end of the year um which in what would be 24 model years so if you're interested in adria twin supreme 640 slb or sgx they're some of our best sellers or an adria compact dl we do have some availability left there so talk to us at hybrid devon about that uh, wild axe wise we've got a couple of these proteus transit campers in automatic guys which are 65,000 with leather diesel heating uh, alloy wheels a couple of color choices um, available straight away and we've got the little Pulsar, these are our best seller for years, so 5 metre short wheelbase, high top, 4 seat belts with a full toilet and shower. And we've got immediate availability of this one, so these can be down as sofas, we've got a proper side kitchen with an oven and a corner bathroom, which is really, really good. So that's 72,000, automatic with uh, quite a few options on it as well. So they're a really good option for those upsizing from a VW camper because um, this is shorter than a long wheelbase VW camper and only 10 centimetres longer than a short wheelbase one but you've got a full toilet and shower. We've got a display model Solaris XL. This has been our best seller this year. Availability on these if you were to order one you're talking way later into the summer now but that's still better availability than some but if you want to have a look at one uh, come down and have a gander. These are 75 odd for a manual, 80 odd for an auto with with some options on like this one. Uh, we also have a demo Aurora XL, which is Wild Axe's sort of unique fixed bed model. So what this offers uniquely for a fixed bed model, is you've got a single seat there, so it's a three berth, this turns into a single bed, and a really good kitchen, which is what you don't get in most van conversions. You've got full oven, big fridge freezer and microwave, and then a transverse rear bed. But the party piece of this is that this whole rear bed folds away up to that side, leaving the entire space empty because there's no cupboards underneath it there. So the entire space is empty for storage, which is really, really clever. So you're both gaining a much better kitchen than any other fixed bed van conversion on the market and more storage as well. So you can have this as a six or a 6.34 meter van. The difference is the six meter one has a lower fridge, loses the microwave, and it doesn't have about 18 wardrobes like this one has. So you lose a bit of internal storage, but you're down to six meters, which some people prefer. Again, availability wise, sometime later in the summer or early autumn. And then we're into some compasses. So we've sold a couple of these recently, but we've got an immediate availability. All of these are for sale. So compass CV80 pop top van conversion with an inlounge. So that's four berth, four seat belts. Compass Concerto 250 with an island bed, automatic gearbox and full leather luxury model at 80,000. Four berth, four seat belts, three and a half ton, but a really spacious luxury van. Just sold the Concerto 255 the other day. Got the little 115 which is new version for this year, just over six meters now, 6.15, because like the Pulsar, um, these had to change when the short wheelbase chassis was discontinued. So these were six meters or 5.8. Now they're 6.15, but it gives you six foot sofas inside for instant single beds or a big double end kitchen. This one's available, or we have ones with some extra factory options due in, and they're not too distant. These are around 60,000 brand new. They're one of the cheapest new vans you can buy today. 
Compass Navigator 120. This one's available. It's an end lounge, narrow body, as you can see, six metre uh, model with uh, six foot rear sofas. Compass 185 is a 7.3. These are narrow, all these avant guards are narrow. 65,000 brand new. That's not current price, by the way. It's been a price increase since most of these compasses came in, so they are a good saving over the future price. That gives you fixed single beds, full width end washroom, twin safer front lounge with seat belts in the mid kitchen, three and a half ton, lots of payload, nice and narrow, easy to drive down the country lanes. This one's 65,793 pounds, and that's available through your manufacturer warranties. Compass 196, only got one of these left. This is the one six berth, six seat belts, end lounge with a front drop down, three and a half ton again, narrow body again. And available straight away so that gives you four seat belted proper three-point belts this makes a double bed at the front you've got a drop down double bed there and at the back you've got an end lounge that makes a double bed as well with a mid kitchen center wet room bathroom again this one is pre-price increase at 66.6 on the road And then we're down into last year's best seller, the Compass 150, 65,793, buys you a brand new 7.3 metre island bed van with a low island bed, uh, which is unique, or well, I think it's unique. So you can see there, very low island bed, not having to climb up any steps to get into. Twin safer front lounge with seat belts, mid kitchen and wet room bathroom again. So the Concerto 250 I mentioned is a wider, posher version of this basically. So. So this is £15,000 cheaper though, although it's not automatic. So that's the compasses new. So we've got good availability for immediate dispatch of compasses. When I say immediate, they have to go through the workshop. So you're probably going to be looking about a month to wait at the moment because we are very, very busy. The industry's still really, really good, by the way. Um, even the little camper sized vans are selling well now. Uh, we did a really good April. It started off really well into May as well. So just because COVID is a, is a memory now, the, the demand is still high. There's a lot of people changing vans they bought in the last year or two for something different. A few new hillsides here. These are all available. So there's an executive and automatic with loads of bells and whistles for 72, brand new, Highline based. And two Birchover classics, which are uh, Short wheel base, these are all short wheel bases. This is a 62 for a manual. Oh, this one's got a sticky door, which is rather annoying. As you can see in there, the classic VW layout. You've got diesel heating, RIV bed, got a water heater as well, and really, really high quality conversion. A few different wood finishes and things like that available with Hillside, and we've got a selection of different exterior and interior colours available. And then we're into the used vans and we've got, if you like the hillsides, this is one that we sold new a year ago. So it's one year old in Ravenna blue. It's got the wind out canopy, the trapezoid or side bars. It's automatic. It's only done a thousand miles. So 59.95 is a saving of several thousand pounds over the equivalent new price. And it's available straight away. Really, really nice van. I think it's 1300 miles, something like that on it. So it's not done not done barely anything so that will sell really quick I think that's my favorite color Ravenna blue as well it really pings it's a lovely thing still got a good selection of other second-hand campers got some less expensive ones here little auto cruise pulse long wheelbase Denby some of these have been reduced my favorite little camper at the minute I'd have this if I could afford it a pioneer converted Nissan MV200 there's individual videos on YouTube of all of these if you can't find them leave us a message or give us a call and we will uh, send you a link i love this this is probably better for one or two small people because it literally is the size of a small car but you've got single swivel passenger seat i can just move it back a bit it's got a rib bed which are french best camper beds on the market a diesel powered hob which you can both use for cooking and heating so it's a gas free van and a really powerful solar panel on the roof and powerful leisure battery setup. So that's done 40 odd thousand miles and it's 26,995. I think these represent great value and they're super reliable and that'll be crazy good on fuel as well. Plenty of other array of 
less expensive campers going right the way down to 16.95 for this high top Miami on the VW T4. It's free of rust. It's got the 2.5 five cylinder di diesel engine, which is super smooth. It's a really nice van. We've just machine polished it and it's got a great shine to it now. So yeah, loads of real good campers. This Auto Sleeper Trooper we've sold before. This one of the last Auto Sleeper factory converted from new troopers. So you've got pop top, you've got uh, gas tank, blown air heating, hot water, high line spec chassis with all the bells and whistles. So it's a really, really well finished, high quality VW camper. One of the last of a long line of VW campers from, from Auto Sleeper up in the Cotswold. Soft closed door on that as well. Rare Mercedes free spirit conversion, that's a Jap import, uh, petrol automatic, individual video on this one, I love this, this has got a proper proper toilet in it, big solar panel on the roof from SC down in Plymouth, this is the other layout, so these have got two single RIB beds in the back of them there, and these will make two singles by converting the rotating both the cab seats quite easy to do actually I've done this and I'm ham-fisted and it's it's not difficult and then you get single beds or you can bring these together to make a double bed plus you've got a roof bed as well and um, freshly converted last summer it's in lovely condition it's a good buy for someone at 32.95 that one this well house that's on hold for someone coming to see it tomorrow they build tremendously high quality ones now this something different it's an Alpine campers Highline. Highline is the top of the range VW chassis uh, conversion on a 2015 transporter. It's only done 40 odd thousand miles. I'll do an individual video on this. Now this hasn't got the cooking facilities, but a lot of people don't want that. It's got real soft leather seats, which are gorgeous. Really good quality cabinet work, all incredibly well finished got a pop top on top which is brand new as well full electrical mains hookup ledger battery and, and zig charging system plenty of storage but because it's not got the the cooking facilities and frankly i've got a camper and i very rarely cook in it i cook outside you can then have a, a triple full width rib bed again rib bed the french top of the range um bed manufacturer these are awesome and that gives you a really good size downstairs bed with three seat belts so you can have a swivel single passenger seat three seat belts that's got all the air con and cruise it's got nav it's got heated seats it's a lovely drive um in this sort of they call it red metallic it's more like a dusky brown metallic but it's in lovely condition just need to wash off where i got it muddy dropping the um previous owner back home yesterday but i think it's 28.95 that's a good buy for someone um if you wanted to put a little pod kitchen in it you could do as well at that it does have a plug-in fridge sort of cool box with it this sterling another van with full leather short wheelbase t5 camper we've reduced that down a little bit swift esprit 412 has just come in a van we sold new lucky enough to buy it back it's in stupendously good condition uh six meter end kitchen model twin sofa lounge makes single beds using the cab seats um 16,000 miles at 39.95 on a 65 plate. I think that's a cracking buy for someone. That's the same van as a Best of Car 412 as well. So Best of Car Swift, same company. So we had a lot of stocks just come in. This Bailey Approach 740. I bought this a couple of weeks ago. 39.95 mega spec, big spacious fixed lounge, fixed lounge, fixed bed model, twin sofa front lounge. That's really really nice at 39.95. Our old friend, this Auto Crew Starburst, needs a clean. Um, not inside, it's not smelly or anything, it just needs a wash off on the outside. So, waiting for the ballot to get round here. We've sold this van as a company um, many, many times. It's an old friend of ours. Uh, we sell it, get it back in part exchange again. Everybody loves it. Uh, 24,95, it's done a bit of mileage, it's done 78,000 miles, but it's an Alco chassis. It's a super spacious van. We often don't sell pre-07 vans, but when we know them, like this one, this one's an old friend of ours, we'll, we will. So it's got a solar panel, it's got an awning. And these are one of the best layouts I've ever seen. It's got a reversing camera, it's got cab air conditioning, which you never see on these. So you've got a twin sofa front lounge, makes singles or a double bed. Really good mid kitchen and a big end washroom with a separate shower in it. All in just over six metres, it's incredible. Uh, Alco chassis, tiny overhang, drives like an estate car. You've got a bike rack on the back as well, sensors and a camera. Um, 
It's a great van for someone, quality. They don't build vans like that anymore. Gas barbecue point, that's a really good thing. Majestic 105, another two berth end washroom compact. All the bells and whistles on that one. A lot of these are vans we've had before, such as this one, so this Euromobil. These are German, tremendous build quality. Um, three and a half ton. This one, it says 36.50, I think it's three and a half ton. 59.95, it's late 2018. It's automatic, it's only done 13,000 miles. Does need a clean. Um, it was previously owned by a member of staff here. Um, so I took this in part exchange, sold it to, uh, sold it to him. So it's a van that we've known, we've known both of its owners. Flat floor all the way through, half leather seating. Fixed twin single beds with a full width end washroom and just amazing quality upholstery and cabinet work for them. It's built like a tank, so that'll clean up really well. It's got the bigger engine as well, so we'll do some individual videos on these. Little Rapido 640, we've got a holding deposit on. Five metre Rome home R30 with a toilet and shower. This Vogue 135 is a cracker, it's only done 3,000 miles, it's only been used once for a trip around France and we bought it and we went all the way to Newcastle to buy it. 56,995, you're saving, I don't know, 10, 12, 13,000 pounds over new price, maybe 15,000 pounds. Got everything from solar to awning, everything you could want, uh, camera on it, barbecue points, external shower, stuff like that. It's a good buy that, 56,995, as is this at 56,995. Now these are really good stock, so it's a Shoson V697, another van that we sold new, so we do get a lot of repeat trade here, that's what we want, if we look after you, you look after us, everybody's happy. Only done 3,000 miles, 56.95, it's got the optional panoramic front roof, the Expedition grey paint, it's got the awning, and these are quite clever layouts, so you've got twin six foot sofas to the rear, really nice little dinette at the front with traveling seats this isn't designed for a bed and because of that they've been able to give you a full-size end lounge and traveling seats and the traveling seats are ergonomically designed so your passengers are actually comfortable instead of sitting on a upright seat that's designed to make a bed you've got an oven in the kitchen as well you've got a proper fridge freezer it's a big end lounge it's in immaculate condition it's just come in yesterday this one it's perfect Nice wet room bathroom like all the panel vans seem to have. And yeah, this is a belting buy for someone. They've put these carpets down themselves, but we'll leave them down. Let's work out how to turn this stereo off before it flattens the battery. Isn't that always the hardest thing? Oh, there we go, that was easy enough. So that's got sat nav and the reversing camera in it. So that panoramic front roof light. It's cracking by 56,995. Great saving over the new equivalent price for a van that you can't get. Very good news that. Coming along, a couple of bunk bed vans, very popular at this time of year. A little Lord Sleeper Lancashire, it's another van that we don't always retail vans at this sort of age bracket, but this gentleman changed for basically the same van. He's had it for years and years and years. And he's really looked after it. It's an 07 plate, 06 model. And it's basically an auto sleeper Nuevo ES. It's only five and a half meters, but it's four berth, four seat belts with plenty of storage. 2.2, it's got the bigger engine. Uh, it's in really good condition. Uh, it's not damp, it's not got any corrosion on it. Just needs a bit of body work on the back, which we'll, we'll do there. You've got twin sofa front lounge, which will turn into forward facing traveling seats, over cab bed for storage or for guests if you want to take the grandkids with you. Nice end kitchen with a full oven and a corner washroom with a toilet and a shower there. So that's a really nice little thing. Uh, not done a lot of miles either. You can say previous owner was really looked after it. It's in lovely condition. That will clean up really, really well. So yeah, plenty of newly arrived used stock. I'll have a quick look around down this road. So this has just come in as well. I've had several vans coming in the last two or three days. Don't get many like this, a 2018 Carthago Chic Sea Line uh, A Class, German, super premium, all metal framework and body construction. See the beautiful curved roof line on it. It's got habitation aircon, it's got tow bar, it's got solar, it's got satellite. It looks like it's got refillable gas, we'd have to check that. Double floor, new, you pay 150 grand for one of these if you get one, which you probably couldn't. 
It's only 7.4 meters. It's actually quite a manageable size. You will need a C1 on your driving license. It's automatic. Eight and a half thousand miles from new. 89.95. I know it's a lot of money for a five-year-old van, but you internet price check these things. That is an absolutely great buy for somebody in fairness to it. So I expect this to sell very, very quickly because you just don't see them very often. And again, just come in, need to valet, but it's not, not doggy. It will clean up really, really well. Got our demo, Titanium 640. We sell one of these a week on average. Availability is running out. Um, have a look at this one, order one for later in the summer. This has just come in, it's immaculate. Obey the Advanced 76 stroke two, 46,995. It's only done 3,000 miles or just under 4,000 miles. And it's a lovely, light, and airy, spacious, three and a half ton, four berth, two seat belt van. For those who are wondering why it's four berth with two seat belts, you can order this with a dinette lounge instead, uh, which would be called a, a 76 stroke four. Um, but this one is for those who don't need to carry people with them, but it will make a bed. So if you want two beds or a guest bed, you've got it. And you've got a nice low fixed double bed, and then a wrap round in bathroom as well with a mid kitchen with a toilet and a microwave and everything like that. Oven, really, really good news. Awning, I think it's got a solar panel, don't hold me to it. It's got a external main socket, external TV point. That's all good. Apache 634, lowest mileage, cheapest one in the country. Don't know why nobody wants to buy it. It'll probably knock that down a bit in price shortly, but it's a really good one if you like a big end lounge van. CI Karaoke 707, loads of interest in that. Seven berth, seven seat belt, not six seat belt. Three and a half ton, family friendly bunk bed model. Cheapest auto sleeper Carinium Duo in the country. That's fixed single beds if you want. If you've got a C1 driving license uh, and you want the ultimate two berth luxury, it's a four berth, but two seat belts. It's a luxury eight metre Alco chassis. Every bell and whistle on it. Um, you won't find a better van than that for 59.95. Show some with a drop down bed that's not even done 2,000 miles for 71.95, saving about six grand on new price. And again, you can't get a new one, but that's available. If you have a house in France or Spain or you want to tour Europe, it's good value 2014. Drop down bedded, show some sweet maxi. That's not on the web, that one. So, uh, this is 6.7 meters with a drop down bed. Very desirable, anything with a drop down bed. So you've got drop down bed above, lounge there, island kitchen, big fridge freezer and an oven, massive storage, massive bathroom with a big separate shower and a big outside storage locker. If that was right hand driver, it'd be another five grand on top of that. So represents good value because how often do you actually overtake on the single carriageways in this country? It's not a problem. A couple of bunk bed vans. Very stylish, Shosong Welcome 17 came down from headquarters and the Shosong Flash 22 that we've bought and sold down here before. Just part exchange at headquarters and we nabbed it from them. This is a drop down front bed with M bunks. So a very, very cool layout. Good pry that, 2013, 34,995. And finally, this big Swift Sundance is a van we sold not that long ago. Took it back in part exchange again. Super spacious, you will need a C1 driving license for this. Very high spec, got lots and lots of kit on it, solar, um, lots of electronic stuff, awnings, tow bars, reversing camera, sat nav thing, all sorts in that. But a massively spacious six berth layout with a big end lounge, full four seat belt front dinette. So six berth, six seat belts, a really good spacious family van. Always sell well and that's priced to sell at 34 nine five so that's it we're still really busy things coming and going all the time so if you don't see anything that's quite right in this video do contact us because we've got lists of people and vans to put together and if you're after certain things you want to use wild x pulsar or used adria twin 640 one of these really popular things that you show on 640 you got to find out about them before they come in contact us Tell us what you want. If we find one, we'll tell you before it comes in and give you the option of securing it, subject to viewing, because that's why you don't see lots of these desirable vans sat in forecourts, and that's because people are actually finding out about them and buying them before they come in. So contact us at Highbridge Motorhomes Devon. Um, I 
can't I can never remember the phone number, but check it out. Check it out on the website. It's 01626 something Google Highbridge Motor Homes Devon. Check us out on the highbridgecaravans.co.uk website or you can contact us direct on the mobile 07432662558 or just come and see us. We're right off the South Devon Expressway. All of our vans come with a major engine service, not just an oil and filter change like the competition. A 12 month in house warranty that covers you for damp on any age of vehicle, unlike the competition's aftermarket insurance backed warranties where they try and abdicate responsibility to a warranty company. We warranty them out of our pocket, we get full habitation service, a full valet, and uh, we'll make sure everything is working. Detailed handover on collection and two free nights or one free night on 12 Oaks Campsite. Who are them? Who are just two miles down the road that we're at, down in lovely South Devon. So come and see us, Highbridge Motorhomes. Devon. Thank you very much. Goodbye.